something. So here is a video. I will share the link for the registration, but basically this is the process. Okay, so let's uh, start. I do not have the voice here. Okay, so let's start. So this is a business account submission. You first fill up your email and then your name. And here is your um, legal business name. Okay. I just go to my um, Facebook business mat business uh, settings and copy my business name. It need to be exactly the same. I do not want uh, you know any confusions, but I always use the exactly same legal business name. And then you choose your password, you know, select a very secure password. And then you need to connect your credit card for the payment. Okay. And as you can see in the screenshot, it's only $5 per month. Okay. Just, uh, I will skip this part and you click confirm the terms and then after you accept the terms it will redirect you to connect your facebook business account okay and you just uh, click the continue and it will ask you to log in your facebook account if you haven't already so basically it's uh, provide um yeah, it create a new or select your existing Facebook account. So usually I just select uh, my existing Facebook account and continue, click the continue. And here it will show you that it will register and connect your WhatsApp business account to 360 dialog. Okay. And you will need to create a new WhatsApp business profile and verify a phone number. So this is also to show you how to connect. Okay, here is the steps you need to choose which business manager you want to connect. And here is, uh, uh, let me see. Okay. Okay, here is you need to select the Google Business Ma Manager, right? And here you need to make sure that the name, the business name, the WhatsApp business account name is the same with your legal business name. And then wait, your account is already set up. And here is uh, the steps that you need to create the WhatsApp business profile. Basically, you need to select, you need to decide which display name you are going to use. Okay. They have very, very strict regulations, you know, requirement for this display name. Because, for example, you cannot use all capitals. Okay. And also, you cannot use, um, yeah. So, you need to follow the guidelines to, to, to get this, um, you know, display name work. So let's just uh, go through the next step. And also your display name can be different from your legal business name. Because imagine that I have a business, but I have several brand and the same business. But you need to provide the website URL or you need to provide some um, some documents to prove the connection. Okay. Otherwise, uh, it's uh, very difficult to get a, a name that is different with your legal business name. So that you can get it work, but there's uh, some extra things you need to prove. So in this case, I just uh, 
it cannot be all capitals so i will just change the the display name and i will remove this uh, and click this uh, display name is different from my legal name i will make sure that they are the same just not all in capitals so that will work okay and then continue and then you just select the category which categories you want to put your business in and after that i think we are all done so i just choose a professional service oh yeah i still need to verify this phone number okay and you can ask it uh, to send your text message and uh, just provide the verification code here. And then that's the last step. After you click this, it will wait. It will take two or three minutes and it will set up your number and also it will provide your the API keys. So that's easy. Okay. And then, as you can see, that I already um, got my API keys here. And then I copy the API keys. I go to UChat and go to WhatsApp. I'm able to, you know, paste my, add my phone number and paste my API keys here. So that's, that's the whole process, how to get uh, um, WhatsApp number and how to get the API keys from 360 dialog. After you paste everything in, click add, and then you are all good to go.